here at the uh, cash converters and we're about to go in this is the inside of the store they buy your platinum gold jewelry and also sell uh, blu-ray so it's their crummy uh, VHS collection over there but see if we can get in there I don't know employees look this pretty looks, looks like it's gonna be pretty hard this guy yeah. looks like a bodybuilder over there He's picking at his ear oh, I think he just picked his nose oh, that's a good all right, so we're gonna go in now. We're like wasting time. It's gonna close any second. <laughs> All right, so we made it into the cash converters. Look around here; they got some sports memorabilia. And here they got a supposed signed Magic Johnson print. Cost two hundred forty-five dollars. Signed, it says. And uh, see how Magic is spelled here, right? M-A-G-I-C, well, this thing, turn it around, here's the supposed certificate of authenticity uh, by BLT Authentics, and uh, authentic stickers like peeling off here. The funny thing is, they even made a fake serial number, and I'm only assuming this is not real because they spelt magic, M-A-J-I-C. I'm pretty sure if someone... Uh, brought in a real Magic Johnson uh, print, they probably, you would assume they would spell the name Magic right. I mean, even if it wasn't Magic Johnson, like, unless you're in kindergarten, you wouldn't get it that simple of a word wrong. So I don't know if that's authentic, so it kind of questions all the other ones. Um, this is supposedly signed as well. It, I mean, it's nice that you put it on your wall, but it's a little risky for that price. Here's all their uh, movies and stuff. Uh, I'm sorry, video games. Yeah. Call of Duty, Modern Warfare 2 for 20 minutes. Is there uh, uh, Atari games Atari here? Games. Yeah. yeah. Some Sega. Let's go over to the thing right here. Got some iPods. It's the Blu rays they got here. Not too many great deals here, or not too many great movies to pick from. We got the Bones, first season, 25 bucks. Making a video for online. Nothing much. 